C. V. Raman is one of the most renowned scientists produced by India. His full name was Chandraskara Venkata Raman. For his pioneering work on scattering of light, C. V. Raman won the Nobel Prize for Physics in 1930. Chandrashkara Venkata Raman was born on November 7, 1888 in Tiruchinapalli, Tamil Nadu. He was the second child of Chandraskar Iyer and Parvathi Emma. His father was a lecturer in mathematics and physics, so he had an academic atmosphere at home. He entered Presidency College, Madras, in 1902 and in 1904 passed his BA examination, winning the first place and the gold medal in physics. In 1907, C. V. Raman passed his MA, obtaining the highest distinctions. During those times, there were not many opportunities for scientists in India. Therefore, Raman joined the Indian Finance Department in 1907. After his office hours, he carried out his experimental research in the laboratory of the Indian Association for the Cultivation of Science at Calcutta. He carried out research in acoustics and optics. In 1917, Raymond was offered the position of Sir Taraknath Pallet Professorship of Physics at Calcutta University. He stayed there for the next 15 years. During his tenure there, he received worldwide recognition for his work in optics and scattering of light. He was elected to the Royal Society of London in 1924 and the British made him a Knight of the British Empire in 1929. In 1930, Sir C. V. Raymond was awarded with Nobel Prize in Physics for his work on scattering of light. The discovery was later christened as Raymond Effect. In 1934, C. V. Raymond became the director of the newly established Indian Institute of Sciences in Bangalore, where two years later he continued as a professor of physics. Other investigations carried out by Raymond were his experimental and theoretical studies on the diffraction of light by acoustic waves of ultrasonic and hypersonic frequencies published 1934 to 1942 and those on the effects produced by X-rays on infrared vibrations in crystals exposed to ordinary light. In 1947, he was appointed as the first national professor by the new government of independent India. He retired from the Indian Institute in 1948 and a year later, he established the Raymond Research Institute in Bangalore, where he worked till his death. Sir C. V. Raymond died on November 21, 1970.